It's so interesting to me that you have this life mission that's so important, it impacts so many women. But who were you to, to get you to this point? Well, I was the second child. So I think that's always, you know, you always struggle for attention and then there were three more. So you really struggle for attention <laughs> uh, in, in that. Not struggle, you figure out how to get it. So, so I think that's, that's one thing. But I grew up in a very political and very uh, community-oriented household. My parents were very active in uh, local politics and in our neighborhood. So I saw that. And I saw my father's political rise, which taught me an enormous amount about power uh, and how you exercise it and what it's for. And that was pretty interesting to me. Uh, I wanted to be able to influence what was going on around me. Uh, and I saw how it worked and thought that was pretty cool. So, so I wanted to figure that out. I was not as interested in what went on at home. Uh, I, I, you know, I certainly picked up a few things. I'm a great baker, you know, and all that kind of stuff. But that was not what, what where, the, where the excitement was, 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 you know, in the political arena. So I went into, I think, the kind of work that I do because it was where I could have um, influence and make a difference. I think that you are a trailblazer. Because it was happening to me. Because it was happening to me. I mean, I literally am that generation where it changed right in front of me. Or, or I could see what was coming and said, I'm going that way. Uh, it was happening right in front of me.